do you ever get claustrophobic in yeah. those type of cars? It is definitely, um, yeah. It's hot and the helmet is, it's really tight and you're kind of like strapped, like really, really strapped in the seat. You have a Hans device for your neck um, and you have a helmet on top of that. You have this uniform on that is so hot. It's fire retardant, so it's like really, really hot and it holds a lot of heat. And then you're in this car that you have to step inside of like one foot at a time. And you're in this seat that's kind of like tight against your hips and then you have these um side panels on the side of the seat and a helmet and a hans device and you have like five different seat belts on so yeah it can get very claustrophobic and it's very very hot but a lot of um the the newer helmets have the um air conditioner hose in it so at least i guess your face can be cold <laughs> or cool but yeah, it's, it can get claustrophobic. Now, like those nice car stock cars, what's the highest they can go uh, miles per hour wise? What's on the dash? Uh, we don't have um, speedometers oh. on there. There's no speedometers on the car. Um, but uh, let's say at Talladega, which is the biggest track in America, um, they go 210 in the corner with like, mm, you have a lot of G-force. Um, with you, so yeah, that's that's in a corner. You're going 210, so you can imagine a straightaway. What's the fastest you think you've ever gone in a car before? Or the fastest clocked? I think I've ever gone um, was about between like 170, 180, trying to work my way up to because you can't go that fast on all the tracks. They're diff they're different size tracks. So whichever track you're on, that's just kind of how, like the smaller tracks, of course you can't go that fast, period. Um, and like a Talladega, you know, you can go, like I said, 210, but the fastest I've gone was like 180, trying to work my way up to 200. But How, how scary is it, or not so scary, uh, around those miles per hour? Oh, it's it's scary, you have to have, you always have to keep fear in your head because once you get too comfortable that's when things can go really really wrong you always have to it, not be totally afraid of the car but you have to have a little bit of fear because you can actually die from from this and there's been several people that have lost their lives um in these cars so you always have to have a little bit of fear in the back of your head worst accident you've been in if i haven't been in one yet praise god 